<laughs> What's going on, YouTube? So, half the police called on me about my video. I'm glad that I have a life, that's all I can say. Because when you're lacking having a life, you tend to do stupid ass shit. Where you keep involving yourself in other people's world and shit like that. Listen to some vibe cartel in the background. A vibe in the vibe cartel. And just kind of walking around and enjoying myself. Na 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 na. Life's sweet. Na 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 na. Life's sweet. <laughs> I love me. I love me. I love what I stand for and all the above. I really feel bad that I lost the match to this earring, so now I have to kind of rock it, kind of like a punk rocker like look. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so. And it's still cute. So, this morning, I woke up to bang. It's like 8 o'clock this morning and banging on my door. Nah, 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 nah. Turn to bang, 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 bang. And bang, and bang. And then I realized who it was. And I chose not to open the door because I had that right. So... Shortly after the police came to my house. Over a YouTube video. When in fact I'm the one that's being harassed. <laughs> Whatever. Smooches to you, honey. I'ma keep praying for you. The Bible says pray for your enemies. And that's what I'm doing. So what y'all think about that, YouTube? What y'all think about all that? <laughs> it's funny as hell to me. So today I got um, some errands to run, some things to do, some fun stuff to handle. And... <sighs> they outside camping out in front of my apartment, so I can't wait to go outside. Because you're stalking me. Like, you are harassing me. Why are you hanging around like that? So, they outside. And they wait for me to come outside. Go figure. So, I just flipped the camera around. Because I felt like, in no particular reason, I just want to say that I can't wait to get out of these freaking apartments. Oh, my God. I'm so tired of them. I'm so sick of these apartments. I'm so sick of the people in these apartments. I'm so sick of the mess. I'm so sick of the, you know, the people who don't have a life to keep up the mess. It's just really tiresome, y'all. So I can't wait. So that's all I'm saying. So here's the deal. A bitch will start something. Or get some shit crunk. And then. When you. As a person defend yourself. And whichever way it is. Or how you defend yourself. It doesn't matter. But don't start nothing if you don't want none. Why do people start shit? And then they want to go and call the police. And do all of that shit. And whine. When the person that they're starting the shit with. Retaliates. And they, like I said. Whichever way it is. Why do people do that? I don't know. I'll never learn. That's why I said. Larger people. <laughs> Fat people. Straight up. Like, there are some overweight people who actually do something with their life and are not miserably meddling and keeping messed up and showing their miserable life. And then there are some who don't and just keep doing it. So, I don't know. Start some shit. And... Then when it starts getting too hot in the kitchen, 
for you, you call the police. <laughs> this person has done enough, y'all. She's already called housing on me, six housing on me. Have done, have done, have done everything in her power. Everything in her power, every attempt she can to try to bring Trace down. And I keep telling motherfuckers that I am not to be brought down. Like, I keep smiling and I keep going on and the shit just don't bug me. So, like, you're wasting your freaking time and your energy. Like, good energy you could be using exercise or something. Instead of literally keep trying to fuck with me and bring me down because it's not going to work. See, I don't give up. I don't wave the white flag. It's times that I feel like I want to give up. It's times that I feel like I can't go on. But it's not in my blood to just give up and not go on. It just really drives me more when I feel like I can't go on. That only drives me and makes me want to go on. That makes me want to go on. So, to say the least, I think that if you're going to start something with someone, by God, please by all means, be prepared for what comes back to you because karma is a revolving door and she comes knocking a whole lot earlier these days. So, like, for real, back the hell up and get you a life. And I realize that things are terrible for you, but don't try to bring your misery into other people's world. You know, that's why I don't surround myself around you. And that is why I had always made sure that I stayed away from you in so many words. I just realized I want my black ring on. Where is it at, man? So, um, I did not notice my black ring is missing. Really? No, here it is. But yeah, so I don't know. An individual like that, I feel bad for. Him. Sorry for. Him. Oh, hi. Mm -hmm. I was going to wear it on this finger, but I don't like that. So, anyway, y'all, I'm done. I might be back. I might not. I don't know. I just like looking at me. And you should too. Bye.